tonight at 5 o'clock with new information on the story that WBZ broke. An FBI search of a Peabody shop which sells what its owner calls creepy dolls. WBZ has learned that the FBI visited that shop and the owner's home as well. Thank you for joining us. I'm David Wade. And I'm Lisa Hughes. The FBI says there is no threat, but they're also not explaining yet what the agents were looking for. Let's get right out to WBZ's Jordan Jagalins, who are live in Peabody. And Jordan, what have you been able to learn today? Well, David and Lisa, as you mentioned, there are a lot of questions remaining as to why that federal investigation is happening, looking into that doll company located here in Peabody. And it's a question that a lot of people want answered, including several neighbors of the shop owner that we spoke to today in Salem, who say they would certainly like to know what the FBI was searching for. What is it? Is there a body buried? Why, why the FBI? It doesn't uh, make any sense. Cat's Creepy Creations searched by the FBI at Mills 58 in Peabody Tuesday. They're all like around the hallway clearing out that, um, that space upstairs. Meanwhile, investigators were seen hauling items from the owner's home on Pleasant Street in Salem. They set up two tents in the backyard. They spent eight hours here uh, collecting a large number of boxes, totes, bags. Cat's Creepy Creations describes itself as art that will shock the mind and shake the soul. They say they specialize in bone art, posting a real human skull on Instagram, saying, quote, if you're in the market for human bones, hit me up. And here, displaying 11 real human vertebrae. It's just a tad unnerving if you really want to know, especially seeing people in Tyvek suits. Neighbors uneasy about what exactly the FBI was searching for as agents were seen out digging in the doll maker's backyard. It's kind of creepy. This is a very quiet area. Nothing ever really happens. The owner telling WBZ she had no comment when she was approached today. In a statement, an FBI spokesperson tells us, quote, the FBI was at both locations yesterday conducting law enforcement activity in connection with an ongoing federal investigation. To protect the integrity of the investigation, we're going to refrain from commenting on its substance. However, there's no threat to public safety. And we did speak with one of the property managers here at Mills 58. He did not wish to comment on this story. We also called the federal courthouse and any search warrant documents will be sealed until an arrest is made. Live in Peabody tonight, Jordan Jagelinzer, WBZ News. Jordan, thank you. And WBZ 